Hey girl, hey! Welcome back to my channel everyone. Today I want to show you guys some cool science experiments or tricks. I haven't done a science video in months and it is extremely requested and finally here it is. I'm going to show you guys a few of them. Not too crazy, not like 20 or anything, but just a few. Let me know if you guys want to see more videos like this. I hope you guys enjoy. Please click that like button if you enjoyed. Comment down below and subscribe if you are not and let's get straight on to this video. So the very first science project we're going to be trying is the fireworks underwater. This is actually super easy to make and super cool to look at as well. We're going to need about half a cup of water or a third. It doesn't really matter. Just fill your container with some water. You're going to need some baby oil on the side. Maybe about a few layers. It doesn't matter how much you put. And you're going to need some food coloring water based because water is not going to mix with the oil and that's what you want. You're going to put some drops in there and it's going to stay there. It's not really going to separate because again, water doesn't mix with oil. Now go ahead and take a fork and whisk everything together. You're going to see a bunch of tiny little droplets begin to form and then we're going to pour that into the water. Then instantly you will start to see the food coloring start to sink to the bottom where the water is at and it just looks really cool and that ladies and gentlemen is the fireworks underwater science experiment. Next we are doing a lemon volcano. You're going to need two lemons. For the first lemon we're going to go ahead and cut the bottom off just so it could be able to stand. To the same lemon we're going to take the other side and cut off a piece and you don't really necessarily have to like cut it in half. Just cut off to where you see that you can actually see the inside. Then I'm taking a knife and I'm going to carve out some of the lemon, the inside of the lemon. I'm not going to take out too much, maybe just like halfway. So put that aside and we're going to go on to the other lemon, cut it in half and we're just going to pour all the juice into a container. Going back to the lemon that we started, we're going to go ahead and take some food coloring and pour it at the top where I carved it and we're also going to take some soap. Take some baking soda as well, a spoonful. Go ahead and pour that in and mix everything together and then we're going to go ahead and add the lemon that we put on the side and then BAM! You have your lemon volcano and then you can add some more colors to it and it's just a cool experiment to try with your friends or with your kids etc. This next one is rain in a jar. It's basically to show how rain happens and it's really easy to do it as well. You're going to need three fourths of water into a container and you're going to need some shaving cream. Shaving cream is going to act as the cloud and then you're going to take some food coloring and pour it on top until it starts to come down like rain. So if you're doing this experiment with a kid, you're going to explain to them how the cloud is made. So what happens is a lot of water droplets rise in the air and condense on dust particles. A huge group of these together is called a cloud. The water then collects in the cloud until it is too much. That's when it will start to leak through and it makes rain. So that is what we're showing here with food coloring. You're going to keep putting some until it starts to go through the cloud, aka shaving cream, and come down as rain. I also went ahead and added different colors just because it looks really cool and that is it for the rain in a cup science experiment. This next science trick is the coolest thing ever. I was so excited about this. I didn't even realize how excited I was until I looked back at the clips hearing myself. I was way too amazed. And I just had to share this with you guys because when I found out about this, I was like, what in the world? What kind of sorcery is this? So you're going to need a Ziploc bag with water and some colored pencils or pencils or pens or basically anything sharp and just stick it through it. I want to show you guys some raw footage right now of me when this happened. I was just so amazed. Just listen to me. Oh my god, dude. Focus it. Nice. Oh my god, I thought it was actually gonna pop. Wow, this is so cool. Like, it doesn't even leak or anything, huh? Oh my god, it's crazy. Dude, little kids would be obsessed with this, huh? Dude, you don't even have to, like, go, like, what the heck? Yo, this is crazy. Show it like that. <gasps> This is so cool, dude. I I thought it was gonna leak or something. What the heck? 
Oh my goodness, I know I probably sound ridiculous in there. I was looking back and I was like, why was I so excited? But honestly, just try it. You're going to be amazed. I thought it was going to pop or something. It doesn't even matter how slow you put them in. It's just some kind of sorcery, simple science. It is just so fun. And that is it for this video, you guys. Thank you guys so much for watching. I love you and I will see you in my next one. Bye!